as a fellow uh, clinician, um, and you also have extensive experience, let's move on and talk about what are some of those effective strategies or evidence-based practices that educators and practitioners can implement to better support um, Black autistic gifted students in the classroom or just Black autistic students, period, because I know that that is something that is a struggle. Right, and, and when we think about um, evidence-based, I'm a big fan of collaborative and proactive solutions, and that's an evidence-based model problem solving, right, at its core. Um, one of the things we, we say when you see an autistic student, you just see one, right? And, and one of the things I really emphasize with the families that I work with is that that identification doesn't tell me much, right? I still have to sit down with my student and I'll say things like, tell me, what's your difficulty when it's come time? Today to we have it, a very right? special guest. Um, and I'll hear things Today like, we are here with Jamila, who is an education 